Hi, my name is Robert Dean Steele, and this is Real Dads. We've been talking about what a gentleman is. I want to share with you about a very important part of being a gentleman. A gentleman is someone who always makes those around him feel as comfortable as possible. Also, a gentleman is concerned about honoring those that are in his presence. For example, if it's your wife, you want to show to your children and to those around you that you love this woman, you honor her, and you respect her by the way that you treat her. Also, as well, you show your male children what a gentleman is all about, and then you show your uh, female children uh, basically what they should be looking for in a, in a man. Raise the bar, guys. Raise the bar. Now, the one I'm talking about today is very, very important. A gentleman always keeps his wife's secret. Always, when a woman decides to entrust him with a piece of information, you should be as silent as the grave, if I may use that term. You see, should a breakup happen, for example, a gentleman can be trusted with that type of information. He's not going to blab around the situation. He, when someone entrusts you with some special information, it's just a sign of respect. You're not a gossip. You are an individual who can be trusted with the secret. You are an individual that can be trusted with information. Why? Because it shows that you respect that person. It shows that you care enough for them that you're going to keep that information. Also as well, it shows your love for God. You see, God keeps our secrets. God knows everything about us, but he doesn't blab it about us. And a godly individual will always do that. So today, if someone shares with you, especially your spouse, a piece of information, you keep it to yourself. Also, when you do this for your children, what you are showing to them is this, that when someone entrusts you with a piece of information, you keep it. Because the simple fact is, it's a piece of information that is important to, uh, uh, you're showing honor and respect for them. Now, I just want to do one quick clarification. If they share an information with you that's illegal, if they share a piece of information to you that uh, is makes them, uh, I, I use that word illegal, you know, then of course you're going to have to say to them, well, I'm sorry, this piece of information, you know, is uh, a piece of information. Or they say to you, I want to share with you a piece of information th that may be illegal. Then you say to them, you know what, maybe you shouldn't share it with me because you're going to put me in an awkward position. But you know what, if it's a piece of information that is, that is uh, special and they have shared it with you, what you're doing is they're saying to you, I trust you. I trust you with this information. And don't break that trust is basically what I'm saying. My name is Robert Dean Steele. You have yourself a great and godly day.